Hello everyone, welcome to our another tutorial. In this tutorial, we will show you how to connect your contact form 7 with your MailChimp list so that every time someone submits your form, uh, the email data and users data get passed to your MailChimp list. So let's get started. So this for this tutorial you need to install our plugin called Ultimate Addons for Contact Form 7 and obviously you have to install Contact Form 7. Uh, let me deactivate the other plugins we have. So we have Ultimate Addons for Contact Form 7 and Contact Form 7. Uh, in our other video we already covered how to install a plugin so you can check those out uh, so after you install ultimate addons for contact form 7 what you have to do is you have to go to contact and ultimate addons and then you have to enable this mailchimp add-on and then save now you have to go to the mailchimp uh, tab and then you have to click uh, add the add your MailChimp API. So how to get your MailChimp API? So you can search how to get MailChimp API. So what you have to do is navigate to API keys. So I'm clicking here. It will log in to our MailChimp account. And as you see, we already have an API created. Let me create another API here. So for YouTube video, you can name it as you want. Now let me generate a key. So this is the key. So you have to, you have to copy this key. I don't use my key. And if you do that, then all your submission will come to my account. So don't do that. Use your own key. So now if I save, let's let uh, you can ignore this one so it will be automatically connected later on so now let us create a form let me create a new form so we name this mailchimp and we have this your name and email and subject and message so let's say i am i want to transfer the customer name and email to mailchimp so i have to go to the mailchimp account and enable mailchimp form so we are creating a subscribe form and as you see our audience is here now subscriber email is email name is name subscriber last name is your name so if you want okay let me say let's say this is first name and this is last name so we name it first name and last name we save it now if we go back so subscriber first name is first name and this is the last name and here we can add any custom field you, we want but you, for that you need to create a custom field on MailChimp uh, for the easiness of this tutorial we are skipping this because most of the user will basically want the customer email first name and last name on MailChimp so that's it so let me save so once it is saved let's add this form copy this short code so mailchimp form and publish so as we did it on localhost we don't have any uh, smtp setup so the form submission will not work so what we will do is i'll show you how the form works on the live site so on the live site we have this form here so let's say i fill up and we cannot add any um, 
dummy email because MailChimp will MailChimp will automatically count this as spam. So let's try to add any Gmail. So so let's say it's a, it's also a dummy email just so we don't we bypass uh, MailChimp's verification. So this is a test email test. So if I submit. Uh, the form submission will go to the admin email as usual what con what happens in contact form and the email I added so it should now reflect on our audience all contact list so let me refresh so as you see there is the email and there is the first name and last name for these other items phone number birthday address all these what you have to do is basically so what you have to do is basically add these custom fields here so the more field you add you can do that we'll try to cover this data up in another video so for now that's it um, thank you so much for watching this video if you have any questions let us know in the comments or contact our support thank you